Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Today I've got a Christmas jumper on. Um, no, but I've also got a rather large Sainsbury's haul for you. Um, this is my penultimate shopping haul before Christmas. I will have another one come next Saturday and that is it. But I don't have it for Christmas, it's not getting here. But yes, this came to, or I paid £69 and... 69, I got the receipt. £69.70 and 70 pence for all of this. It is of a greater value um, than £69. Uh, basically, at Sainsbury's, um, if you want to order, order an item and they substitute it, say you order an item for a pound, and they substitute it for an item that's £1.50. Um, you pay £1.50 and then they give you like a 50p credit voucher that you can spend in store. So you get the money back, but only to spend in Sainsbury's, if that makes sense. Um, whereas like other stores like Asda or Tesco's, if the item is a pound um, and they've substituted for it for £1.50, you just pay a pound. So get your money back from both but in different ways anyway what I do with those vouchers I save them up all year and then use them for big shopping so like uh, Christmas and Easter basically that's when I do the biggest groceries um, so yeah so it is of a greater value of £69.70 but that's what this cost me um, I had one freebie I had three substitutions I kept all three substitutions I was fine with that um, right, let's show you what I've got. So, quick overview. Looks like that. Um, so yeah, it might not look like a lot when you... <laughs> but um, we've got a lot of easy meals this week because it's right up to Christmas. John's work life is crazy. I'm not getting home till like 7 o'clock at night. John's even later, so we need quick meals or evenings. Um, but yes, let's show you the thing I got for free. Um, these Kellogg's Nutrigrain, Nutrigrain Apple Bars. I really like these. Um, tried them in the past, uh, but I think they're just... I don't know if it's... Oh, it does say new recipe. It's definitely new packaging, but I already know... Well, I like the old recipe, so I'm guessing I'm going to like the new one. But yeah, got those for free. Um, we got three bottles of Diet Pepsi. Let's just balance that. Christmas decorations getting in the way. Um, I ordered two pints of milk. Um, and they substituted it for two pints of milk, but in little pound bottles. Like, sorry, little pint bottles rather than a two pint bottle. Same brand, same colour, just in the pint format. I got a big jar of coffee. We quite like the dialogue, but it's pure gold. I got some Branston Pickle Original. Necessary over Christmas. Um, out of the pet section, I got a little white bear. It's got like a hard ball in it. Oh, it squeaks. Um, so we got a little polar bear. And then... A little brown bear that has like these red horns. Um, so yeah, one for Darwin, one for Gilly. For Christmas, not before. <laughs> they were like three pounds each. Um, I got some almond cake slices. We got some crispies and sea salt pretzels. Oh, we got some dog treats uh the small bones these are in the ugh, festive turkey got some maltesers because i like me the mini reindeers they're going to be gone soon um got some bisto gravy granules pretty much always buy the less salt because i actually add a lot of salt to my food so and john doesn't like things as salty as me so this this is needed um Another substitute was this. This is to go towards my brother's Christmas present. Um, I ordered this basically, but I think 
I think I ordered the gold and this is the blue. I don't know. It's both hobgoblin. I don't really know the difference, but yeah. That was that. I got lots of gift bags. Uh, have a big family. We are behind on the wrapping process. So I got three packs of gift bags and there's like four or three in each pack. So there's like a gold one, a red one with Christmas trees, I like a tartan and holly one. So I thought that would be very helpful. So I can balance it elsewhere. Yes, right. Um, some Marmite cashew nuts. Some Nibbly Cathedral Bakes. These were uh, on offer for like 75p. Be good for little, that snacky period where you don't do proper meals over Christmas. I thought these might be useful. Red onions, some butternut squash slices, sprouts because every house needs them. Oh, I got another one of these cheese for the cheese board. I got a really good selection of cheese from Asda last week, but uh, this one just sounded good. So it's like cheddar with garlic and herbs. Yum. Um, I've got some katsu curry. I've got a casserole veg mix. Some red grapes. Oh, look at this. Uh, basically a cherry belt, Bakewell cake, because, you know, why not? Um, some easy peelers for John. And then we got some snowy chocolate fingers. Um, I got some dumpling mix, because I'm going to make a stew this week. I got one of these. Never know how to pronounce it, but that's what I got. Um, this was my other substitute. I ordered chicken thighs. They substituted it for the mini fillets. It's fine. It's to go into a um, risotto anyway, so I've got to cut it up anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Cocktail sausages. And then at some point over Christmas, I'm going to try and make a mould cider apple juice type deal. Um, so I've got some star anise and some whole clothes to go in that. Oh, I've also got an apple juice. Did I tell anybody that? <laughs> I can't remember if I pointed that out. Um, and then we've got some diced beef for stew. Oh, I've got cocktail sausages. Did I say that? My memory's all over the place today. Um, we've got some chicken, breaded chicken fillets. Uh, the lazy meals. So we've got some shepherd's pie. It's from the Taste the Difference range. And we've got the fish pie, which is amazing. It is so yummy. Me and John both really like that. Got some jacket potatoes. I got some Tesco finest pear and mulled cider chutney. It just sounded good to me. I just thought that sounded really nice. Um, then we got these minted lamb grill steaks. They're just like burgers, but lamb. Um, some ice cream cones. And then we got some fish cakes in. Uh, haddock. So yeah, haddock, fish cakes, and then a bag of frozen veg, which is peas, sweet corn, green beans, and peas. Carrot. What? Uh, green beans, peas, sweet corn, and carrot. Yeah, that's what we've got. That is this week's groceries. Um, yeah, one more before Christmas, but because of how I upload, it always confuses people that the amount of comments I get that says, oh, that's out of date. It's not. I record it on the Saturday and it goes up the following Sunday. So, yeah. So probably by the time you see my actual Christmas food haul, Christmas would have gone. But hey-ho. So yes, that is this week's food haul. I hope you have enjoyed the video. I hope everything is good with you guys and I'll talk to you in the next one.